<clears throat> Hi, you guys, and thanks for tuning in. So, doo -doo. I am crocheting right now. I am making a piece to go to my swimsuit. Yes, I'm making a two piece. Today, is um, Monday and um, I don't know I was feeling kind of slow today I guess you can call it slow my body was just really just weak I don't know I felt really tired today and um, I don't know I don't know if it's because I started the medicine back up I just want to stop taking the medicine but oh so i worked out today for the first time it's been two months since i started experiencing the pain so you know the doctor said to work out so i worked out today and i did 600 step up yeah i know my box and then i did a 30 minute like a light jog around the apartment so that was kind of interesting kind of fun I just feel like you know I can do it go do more yeah because I just really enjoy working out and my friend was saying slow down maybe you should take it easy the first day it's funny because I don't know how to take it easy I just don't my body just my body is just zoom 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 so I said, no, I'm going to just go for it, you know, and if my body say, stop, then I'll stop. But, I was fine. Yeah, so I enjoyed that. And, um, so this is for the two piece. And it's just a single stitch and it is going to be long which I think I'm making it too long but it's better to be safe you know than to be sorry because I don't have a pattern I'm just kind of just kind of picturing this in my head and just going with it um, so I'm changing my name and I will no, no longer be the masterminder SM and for those of you who don't know the SM is Sakina 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 Miles and so I'm thinking about changing my name to Sakina's life Sakina's life. Sakina love you. Sakina loves you. Sakina continues. I don't know. I'm just trying to figure it out. No, I need to hurry up though. Because I should have did that today. I should change my name today. So, I think, I don't know. I'll just make it plain and simple to be Sakina's life. I kind of want to move on, kind of. And you know, at first I was saying I wanted to move on, you know, and leave what I had been through behind. And then yesterday I woke up and my eye was swollen. And it's because I have allergies and sometimes that happens. My eye will swell up. It reminded me of when I was in prison my eye, I woke up and my whole eye was just swollen at the top. And it was on a Saturday. And basically, the prison didn't care, you know, but there was nothing that they can do because the medical office was closed. But I remember I had to go to dinner. And I'm going to describe all this to you, which is really, 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 really horrible. 
this is horrible. This is like something that you don't even want to imagine. Like <laughs> sad to have to deal with this and go through this. But I did. I went. I went through this. So I could just remember. You knew that dinner was at 5:30, and the door popped. Popped. They unlocked the door. Cause the door popped because it's loud as boom, boom, boom. Boom, and you hear boom, 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 going all down the hall. They are unlocking the doors to let you out your cell. And um, so you have to stand out, step out the door, stand in front of your door, and you have to be quiet and you have to be ready to go. Your hands have to be down to your side. You have to just be standing there straight, you and your roommate, your bunkie. And then... Um, you know, once it's quiet and still, there's upstairs and there's downstairs. And I remember I was upstairs, then they decide who go first, up or down, and they might say, upstairs go. You know, then you kind of excited, yay, we get to go before downstairs. Because you, you're hungry. You're hungry, it's sad. Yeah, yeah, it's sad. You're hungry, and you're ready to go eat. You know, so you want to go first. So they say, upstairs go, and downstairs say, oh, but still you got to be quiet. And so it's kind of like room one, two, three, four, five, six. So you kind of just go. So it's forming a line as the rooms go. And if you want to wait for your girl, your home girl, you kind of walk slow. So she can catch up or she kind of walk fast, kind of catch up before you actually get downstairs in the line. Because you had to be in a line. And they were really strict about the line. And so you get in this line and then you walk outside. And the officers are mean, and they're like, "Who's talking? You better be quiet. Who is that? You know." And so, put your hands down to your side. Who is that whispering? You know, because regardless of what they tell you to be quiet, you know, it's always somebody talking. Somebody just don't want to follow the rules, just mess it up for everybody else. And so you have to walk and you have to make sure that your hands are down to your side. That was really important that you walk in a straight line. And they were always screaming, this line not straight. Straight the line. You, you move in. Move over to the right. Oh, they're just stupid. Just wanted a straight line. And the ch what they call it, the chow hall was, oh, dang, how did I end up doing that? Ooh. See, I'm, I started talking. And um, I started doing something. Ooh. Something totally different than what I'm supposed to be doing. Wow. I'm not going to start all over. Okay, so. The chow hall is what they call it. So you walk in this long line. Chow hall was way. You had to walk, you know, straight line. And then straight line this way. Kind of far. So if it was burning up high, you're going to just burn. If it's raining, you're just going to get rained on. And it was funny because they, you know, they gave us beanies. So you had to wear this beanie. So everybody had these beans on these big old blue coats. They kind of looking like a dude. They might look like dudes, right? <laughs> but anyway, I'm telling this story because it reminded me of my eye. And um, I was so embarrassed because my eye, I looked like a freaking, freaking, like, it was bad. Like somebody beat me up. I just looked bad, real bad, right? So, you know, I can remember it's like trying to keep my head down. As we walk in this line to the kitchen, and then we walk to the line to the kitchen, and I remember you couldn't use the phone, and the only way you could use the phone is if one of the officers allow you to use the phone for a special reason. But they would say, okay, if you clean clean the yard, so you had to go outside and clean up, empty trash, pick up trash around the yard, and then I'll let you have a phone call or. There was this one officer that would play, will give you like a trivia question. And if you, whoever answered it, then you would win that phone call. So he would say something like, Mississippi had three rivers. The fourth river is located something down or up or something. And so you have to answer it. He wanted everybody to put it on a piece of paper. And at the, later on that evening, they would go around and collect all the pieces of paper and see who got it right but then you could get a phone call and um that was the only way you can get a phone call 
But the officers who actually ran the unit, if the ones that were flirt when they came and if they like you and if you flirted with them, if you were pretty and there's somebody that they like, then they would give you a phone call. But other than that, you just, you couldn't call home. And I went, oh my God, Whew. I went over a month without calling home. Over a month without calling home and talking to my family. So that was a really hard time. But anyway, so, yeah. So in the kitchen, and I remember my eye was swollen. But then it made me remember when I first got there and I got to the kitchen, and you sit down, and you can't just sit anywhere you, you want. You have to sit. First table fill up, second table fill up, third, like that. And I can remember, you have to be quiet. The kitchen has to be quiet. And so you have to hurry up and eat. You have to hurry up and eat. Because they're going to say, go. Like, this table, go. Get up, go, go, go. And then this table, go, 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 go. So, you know, everybody will be eating fast because they're going to get to your table and then you got to get up and go whether you finish or not. So you had to eat fast. But um, I remember... There was a, a commotion going on behind me. I'm like, what's going on? And then you could hear the girl scream, I don't give a elf. I'm not sitting with no baby killer. Elf this she and she picked up her tray and she slammed a tray on the table and food flew everywhere and the officer got her and pulled her up out of there. So, you know, I asked what was going on, and so they said the girl that I came with. She was a baby killer. And so one thing that they didn't tolerate was baby killers. And wow, I'll just never forget the look on that girl's face. Like, she was just scared to death. I, I think she's in shock and believe she was where she was. And that was just the beginning. Like, I'm sure she knew if they were telling me what was about to go down, somebody had already told her what was about to go down because that look on her face, horrible, 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 but didn't nobody want to sit with her. And so the cops, they don't care. So they, they allow, they do what they want to do. And so they skip that table. You just got her sitting at that table and they skip that table and sit everybody at the next table. And so it continued from there. But, but yeah, I had just thought about that because um, my eye, and I had to go the whole weekend like that. There was no medical uh, attention for me. And they said I had to wait till Monday until the, the medical office opened. So I was just big, but big swole. <laughs> um, so I was trying to hide it. Yeah, stare at people's face. I don't want nobody looking at me like that. But, um, yeah, because I have allergies. My eyes just swell whenever it wants to. So, yeah, yesterday it was swollen. And I, and I looked around and I was like, oh, my God, it just looked creepy. And I was like, uh-uh, that's the devil. The devil trying to get me. I'm going to church. And so, um, please, I got to put a little makeup on and I went to church. Just like that, sure did. So, um, yeah, you guys. Oh, so... I said, leave the masterminder in the past. But then, whew, but then I start to feel like, well, maybe I'm not done. Maybe I better keep telling my story. Maybe somebody needs to hear it. Okay. So, um, can you imagine um, going a month without calling, checking on your children, or talking to your husband? Are you in a significant other? And, uh, can you imagine just being like hungry and you can't eat until five o'clock? Oh man, and then I wouldn't eat. I wouldn't eat in that kitchen. Because it was just all bad. Okay, I'm just tired of this. All right, you guys. So, just a little chit chat. If anybody made it this far, 
if anybody missed all the beginning, kind of go back to the middle, kind of go back to the middle and um, listen, listen to what I had to say. Hi, put that away. Put that away. I'm going to get you. I'm going to get you. I'll get you, mom. Okay, so a little update on my giveaway. There will be... Oh, I did that again. There's going to be two winners. There's going to be two winners. And the second second place second place I'm gonna just give makeup so I have a lot of makeup makeup that I don't use makeup that I purchased makeup that I've won that I don't use it will be new makeup okay. so I'm gonna give that to the second place winner so the first place winner will get two Visa gift cards, and the second place winner will receive makeup, lots of makeup. All right, so I'll come back and do another update sometime this week. So I think I'm gonna do something else, another surprise. All right, you guys, thank you so much for watching this video. Thank you for tuning in. If you guys have any questions, please feel free to ask. And then I'll be more than happy to answer your question on a video. All right, you guys. Okay. Until the next video.